What's going on guys? Greg Ols TV here. I'm here with Yehuda from WaterGen. WaterGen makes water out of the air. Can you show us some of the yeah, yeah. crazy oh, cool things you just showed me like a second ago? Absolutely. Let's start with the car because this is really revolutionary. What we have here is a machine that if you look in between the driver and passenger, this is a prototype, we create drinking water that as you drive your car, three liters an hour of clean, pure drinking water. We're working currently, we launched this division literally two weeks ago, the Water Gen Automotive Division. And as you come walking through our booth, it gets more interesting. It almost feels like, but wait, there's I more. Know it is. Because this is a machine that creates drinking water in your house. It takes the air in your house and replaces a water cooler. You don't have to carry a five gallon jug anymore. So it makes hot and cold hot water? Hot and cold water. And all you have to do, it's the press of a button, takes the air in the room, and makes drinking water. And then, for those of you who realize this, in all these areas in the country that are having problems with water, Flint, the schools, there's lead in the water, and you keep on hearing more and more about problems, we have machines that will take you to city that make drinking water on a larger scale. So if you're in a school, and your school has a problem with water, or you're fed up with plastics, this room, no more plastic bottles. If right. you're a conservationist, why are you buying 24 bottles in the store? Right. You can go, and with the push of a button, you get drinking water. Uh, I read, like, the water tastes totally normal. There's nothing different tasting about it for, versus the tap. It actually or this, is or... better water than what you're getting and buying. You right. know why? because what's in the ground you can't take out of water. You can't take lead out of water. Yeah. You can't test for all the chemicals that we don't even know exist in the ground. Yeah. You can clean air. It's much easier to clean air right. than it is to clean water. So, and these are just three of our technologies, so I urge you to take a look and visit. We have units that on the back of a truck uh -huh. of a F-550 that goes into disaster zones, and after a fire, after the hurricanes, we're there. You don't have to transport right. water. If you realize one of the biggest problems that they have in the world after a disaster is how do you keep people supplied and supplied and supplied with water? Yeah. As long as we have power and we're creating water, you're not trucking in truckloads of plastics that end up back in a landfill afterwards. Right. We're there and we can resupply. We're our own resupplier. So price-wise, what are we looking at for the home unit? The home unit is going to retail in the next six months when we roll it out in the area of about $1,500. Okay. Um, what about the truck? The truck, we don't have a price yet price because it's a prototype. We're okay. going to send it out to manufacturing. Is that going to be built into the truck or is it something anybody could just put into it? We're looking at both parts of the okay. industry, but again, also look at it and how can revolutionize the industry. If you're in an autonomous vehicle, you get in and you have drinking water, yeah, yeah. or imagine when we put it into an RV. Yeah. The biggest problem people have in RVs is how much, how do we get our water, where do we fill up, what do we know? We don't know what we're getting when you drive into a park. But imagine if it's in your RV and as you're driving, you're making water, yeah, so then all of a sudden it changes. It's pretty cool. And then you have all the buses and trucks and trains and boats. You know, reverse osmosis. People think that it's good. For every gallon of reverse osmosis, there's a gallon that's of no good water you're creating. Right. Our byproduct is cleaner air. Perfect. All right, well, everybody, you got it. And I hope you water. enjoyed the tour. <laughs> we did. Water, Jen, Yehuda, thank you so much. And uh, if you want to check out the product, check out the link below, guys.